Ever wondered why some people seem to get more done in less time? Well, it's not magic, it's the art of time management. Time management is the unsung hero of academic success. It's like the conductor of an orchestra, keeping all the different sections in harmony and ensuring the show goes on smoothly. Consider techniques like creating a study schedule. It's like having a roadmap for your academic journey, guiding you to your destination without getting lost, or breaking tasks into smaller parts. Think of it as slicing a pizza, you wouldn't try to eat it all in one bite, would you? And then, there's time blocking, a method that's as simple as it sounds, blocking out specific time slots for focused studying. These techniques can help in reducing procrastination and increasing productivity, because when you manage your time effectively, you're not just studying smarter, you're also freeing up time for the things you love. Remember you've got the same 24 hours as everyone else, it's all about how you use them. Ever read a whole chapter, only to forget everything you learned? Well, that's where active learning comes into play, a dynamic approach that places you, the learner, at the center of the process. It's not just about absorbing information, but interacting with it, molding it, making it your own. Imagine you're a sculptor, and the course material is your block of marble. Active learning is the chisel in your hand, helping you carve out a masterpiece of understanding. One technique is summarizing key concepts in your own words, it's like translating a foreign language into your native tongue. Or try teaching others. They say the best way to learn is to teach, right? Engage in discussions, challenge perspectives, question assumptions. It's like stirring a pot of ideas, keeping them from settling and getting stale. And don't forget mnemonic devices. They're your brain's secret cheat codes, turning tough concepts into memorable nuggets. Active learning is like going to the gym for your brain. It might be hard work, but the results are worth it. Ever sat through a lecture and then couldn't remember a single thing? It's like watching a movie in a language you don't understand, isn't it? But here's your secret weapon to combat this. Effective note-taking. Think of note-taking as your personal translator turning complex lectures into a language you comprehend. It's a skill that, once mastered, can turn you into an academic ninja. Now, there are different ways to take notes, and it's all about finding what works for you. Ever heard of the Cornell method? It's like having a mini quiz every time you review your notes. Or how about mind mapping? It's a visual feast for those who think in pictures. Whichever method you choose, remember organization is key. Regularly reviewing and tidying up your notes can make a world of difference. It's like having a well-organized toolbox, where every tool is easy to find. Good notes are like breadcrumbs back to understanding. Start leaving a trail. Ever read a page of text and then had no idea what it was about? We've all been there, haven't we? It's like being lost in a forest of words. But fear not, with the right strategies, you can master the art of reading comprehension. Let's start with previewing the material. It's like reading a map before a journey. Look at the headings, subheadings, and bullet points. They're your signposts. They'll give you a sense of the terrain you're about to explore. Next, actively engage with the text. Don't just passively read. Be an active reader. Highlight, underline, annotate. Be the Sherlock Holmes of texts. Investigate, interrogate, and decode every sentence. Finally, summarize key points. It's like leaving breadcrumbs in the forest. They'll help you retrace your steps and remember the journey. These techniques are not just about understanding the text, they're about retaining it. They help you to not just read, but to remember. Reading without understanding is like eating without tasting. Savor the flavor. Ever struggled to remember a complex concept or a long list of facts? It's a common challenge, but there's a solution. Visual aids and mnemonic devices. These are your brain's best friends when it comes to enhancing learning and recall. Let's talk about visual aids first. These are like a language your brain naturally speaks. They help transform abstract complex concepts into concrete, understandable images. For example, think of the human body. Trying to memorize all the muscles can be overwhelming but a detailed diagram can make it much easier. Or consider a flowchart to understand a complicated process. It's like giving your brain a roadmap to knowledge. Now, let's move on to mnemonic devices. These are techniques that use associations to remember information. One popular method is acronyms, where each letter stands for a word or concept. Remembering Roy G. Biv is much easier than recalling the order of colors in a rainbow, right? Another technique is visualization. This method helps you associate an image with a concept. For instance, imagining a gigantic roaring lion when trying to remember the term lionize might make it stick in your memory. Both visual aids and mnemonic devices work because they tap into how our brains naturally function. 
they make learning more engaging, more fun, and most importantly, more effective. So the next time you're faced with a complex concept or a long list of facts, remember to call on your brain's best friends. Who said studying couldn't be colorful and creative? Ever felt overwhelmed or lost motivation during your academic journey? If you nodded yes, you're not alone. It's a common experience, but guess what, it doesn't have to be. Keeping your motivation high and avoiding burnout is the key to a successful academic journey. And it's all about balance. Just like a well-made smoothie, the right blend of ingredients can make all the difference. First, let's talk about setting realistic goals. It's like planning a road trip. You wouldn't expect to drive from New York to Los Angeles in one day, right? So, why expect yourself to master an entire semester's worth of material in one night? Break down your academic journey into manageable milestones and celebrate each small victory along the way. Next, staying organized is crucial. It's like having a tidy room. When everything is in its place, it's easier to focus and be productive. Use tools like calendars, planners, or apps to keep track of assignments and deadlines. Don't hesitate to seek support when needed. It's like asking for directions when you're lost. There's no shame in it, and it can save you a lot of time and frustration. Reach out to your professors, classmates, or academic advisors when you need help. Lastly, don't forget about self-care. Think of it as the charger for your brain. Incorporating regular breaks, exercise, and healthy eating habits can energize your mind and body, helping you to stay focused and motivated. Remember, studying is a marathon, not a sprint. Pace yourself and don't forget to take care of you. Ever wondered how to put all these tips into practice? Well, start by managing your time efficiently. Engage actively with the material and take effective notes. Improve your reading comprehension, use visual aids and mnemonic devices, and of course, stay motivated to avoid burnout. These aren't just tips, they're tools in your study skills toolbox. So, start implementing them one by one and watch your academic prowess grow. Remember, the journey to academic success starts with a single step. Start stepping today.